All right, all right, all righty, all right. What's going on, everybody? My name is Pete, but you probably already knew that. But in case you didn't, you guys are watching the one and only Paid to Drive and Pay to Drive Vlogs, day number 1303, coming at you. That's right, everybody. Hope you're all doing well out there. If this is your first time on my channel, first, uh, first and foremost, welcome. <clears throat> Leave a comment right now in the chat over there or in the comments down below saying first time so I could say what's up to you. But if you've been here before, leave a comment saying before so I can also say what's up to you. And if you drive for apps like Grubhub, DoorDash, Uber Eats, or any of the others, you should definitely be subscribed to this channel with all notifications turned on. If you don't know what subscribing is, there's that red subscribe button. Give that a quick tap right now. I'll give you a second to do that. And turn on the little notification bell to the right and set it to all so you don't miss any future uploads so you can always stay up to date. And also, real quick, hit that little like button down below, especially if you drive in the gig economy. Let's get 200 thumbs up. And let's jump on into it. All right. <clears throat> so today's email comes from Devin. So uh, they spell their name D-E-V-O-N. So everyone say thank you, Devin. And this is about DoorDash decreasing the pay, but specifically the base pay. Remember, we've been talking about that. So, so Devin says, hey, Pete, I dash five to six days a week. On average, I decline between 40 to 70 orders a day that are no tip. Let's repeat that. On average, I decline between 40 to 70 orders a day that are no tip. Well, <clears throat> dashing today, I noticed that my base pay was different. Instead of the usual $3 base pay, I'm getting $2.50 to 275. Now, if you remember, DoorDash was saying that they were going to decrease the base pay on the shorter trips. They're trying to push for those longer ones. Remember that? They were raising it by a dollar or so. <clears throat> but the shorter trips, they were reducing. So, uh, hold on one second. Okay. Um, I called DoorDash and they said they haven't changed anything. That is a flat out lie. Three of the orders are orders I do every single week. Same restaurant to the same customer. We all have our regulars out there that we all know by a first name basis, right? Um, <clears throat> DoorDash told me that the reason the pay is different is because the distance or wait time at the restaurant was short. Nope, not true. Same distance because I sit in the same parking lot and the wait time is always 10 to 15 minutes. I find this to be very shady. I've been, I've been dashing for almost a year and a half. I know what's going on. You can't run a game on me. By the way, I'm in the New Orleans area. Thanks so much, Devin. Devin, thank you for writing this in to confirm this, okay, because this is definitely confirmed here, okay? You see, like, I, I just, I, I hope this is a wake-up call to everyone out there who thinks these companies are like, yeah, they have the drivers in mind. They're trying to pull a fast one when they literally have sent out messages to drivers saying, hey, we're changing the way the base pay works. You know, I've made videos on this. I've even had Pedro DoorDash Santiago confirm this to you guys. So, <clears throat> again, it may not be in your market, dot, 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 yet, Y-E-T. See, that's what I feel like a lot of the people who come at me and say, oh, you don't know what you're talking about. Dude, relax. If it hasn't happened to you, it may never happen to you, or it may not happen to you yet, okay? That is the big golden rule with the gig economy, especially with the delivery apps, is every market is different. Pete, you always say that because it's true. Every market is different. They test out different things in different markets to see how to maximize profits, but not necessarily maximize profits for us, maximize profits for them. You know, that's just the way it works. I am not in favor of it, but this is big business. Okay. You know, it, if anybody else is having this issue, please email me at pay to drive stories at gmail.com so that we can share this with other drivers and we can also confirm this. Okay. So now Devin mentions that they are in um, New Orleans. Okay. Right now in the chat over here, 
or down below in the comments. Let me know which market you work in, okay? And have you noticed a change in your base pay? Has it gone up? Has it gone down? And again, like that email they sent out, they said on longer rides, it was gonna go up by like a dollar. But on shorter rides, it could go down by like 50 cents, maybe even a dollar, you know? So in my opinion, this is a confirmation right here. It, it sure as hell looks like it. So with that, you know, unless somebody wants to try and prove me wrong, you know, in a respectful way, of course, not, wow, this guy doesn't know what he's talking about. He's crazy. He knows nothing. This guy literally knows nothing. Okay. Well, I guess being in this for four years, you learn nothing, you know, but yeah, seriously, email it to me, pay to drive stories at gmail.com so we can discuss it. So thank you, Devin. And I do also want to take this time to thank all of our patrons over at patreon.com slash paid to drive. Uh, these people are fantastic. They give a little something every month. And if you would like to sign up, link is in the description down below me. Click show more or in the pinned top comment. Give that a click. And um, what do you call it? And I will do shout outs like I'm about to do in every new video. So when you hear your name called, say, hey, Pete, I heard my name right in the comments of the chat. Of course, our ultimate driver, Marie Sabo Boutwell, 100 bucks a month. She is fantastic. Thank you so much, Marie. And of course, thank you so much to Brian Pomeroy, Heidi Barnes, Kurt Paul, Lee Peacock, Serena Siddiqui, uh, Tulsa Todd, William Boudreaux, Agus, Alan G. Van Horn, Drew Hanor, Fernando Carranza, Frank Haviland, Fresh One, uh, Jason Casta, Justin Case, Katie Coppin, Lulu Laura, Natalie Mosley, Sarah Keston, Scott Freisner, Sherry Cassidy, Stephen Neely, Brian Richardson, Jenny Thomas, John Bonacci, Matt Epperson, Nick G., Terrence Pacheco, and of course, Valerie Brown. Huge shout outs to all of you. And of course, make sure to download the Get Upside Gas app. Yes, you can start saving money on your gas today, every time you fill up. All you do is download the app for free. Links in the description. You pump your gas, print out your receipt, take a picture of your receipt with the Get Upside Gas app, and within 48 hours or so, you'll get anywhere from 15 cents to 45 cents a gallon back, which is pretty fantastic. And if a friend or family member signs up using your code, you'll get paid every time they pump gas. It's called Get Upside. Links in the description. It's free. Download it today. And of course, if you want to get one of these beautiful Live to Drive, Drive to Live t-shirts, they're on sale right now at paid2drivestore.com. Have you checked it out yet? Link is down below, paid2drivestore.com. Super cheap shirts, super cheap to buy, but great quality, nice and comfortable, beautiful. I love these things, man. I wear them all the time. So <clears throat> if you made it to the end of the video, simply comment end 744, end E N D. 744 lets me know you made it to the end and of course hit that red subscribe button down below turn on all notifications i'll give you a second to do that and if you wouldn't mind hit that like button real quick just it's free just just take a second hit that like 200 thumbs up and until next time get that money get that honey keep hustling keep bustling and we'll see you next time right here on paid to drive youtube channel what's up michelle all right that's it that's all i got Thanks for watching. Drive safe. Stay positive in these negative times. Peace. See you in the next one.